So with this webinar today, what I'm going to do is to ask you to put yourself in your patient's position and just think about what kind of treatment you as a patient, as a dentist, would be prepared to have for yourself or maybe your family. It's really important to think about these things when we're considering a patient's thought processes and the barriers to treatments that normally exist. And, you know, wouldn't it be great to be able to get a patient from here to here in just five weeks time? You know, we're not looking at complex uh, long-term treatment here. We're looking at simple removable orthodontics with a brace that's only worn 16 to 18 hours a day. So many more people with mild ortho problems would have this done if they knew how simple it was. And we all know we have patients like this. We all probably have hundreds, if not thousands of patients like this in our practices. The key to what we're gonna show you today is gonna to teach you and show you how getting a patient from here to here could take nine weeks and not nine months. Again, you know, how many more people would have treatment done if they knew it was only gonna take nine weeks? And this is where we get to this whole concept of progressive smile design. So a patient, like this, who originally thought that she wanted to have 10 veneers, wider buccal corridors, gum lift, all the other things that we as cosmetic dentists tell people are so important, was more interested in getting her teeth straightened out first and then having her veneers. But interestingly, as her teeth straightened and we whitened them, all of a sudden the things that we thought and she originally thought were important became not important. And all she was interested in was just doing the edge bonding on the teeth, just to improve the outline. So she was happy to accept a compromise with simple no prep additive edge bonding. And yes, we still have the compromises, but the real victory here is the fact that the patient is happy with us having to go ahead and doing anything really aggressive or elective. And the important thing here is to realize how many more people would have this done compared to the small niche of patients who could really only afford to have eight, 10 or 12 ceramic veneers.